Hola, bienvenidos a todos. Welcome. We are getting ready to have open English mode together. In a few minutes, we will have English class. We are going to practice pronunciation today. So send your comments and read your comentarios. How are you? Como estas? Where are you from? Say hello and introduce yourself. My name is Megan. I am a teacher for Open English. And I am just preparing the technology here for today's Open English mode. So welcome. It is great to see you. Bienvenidos. I see people are starting to say hello. Hello, Alandrejita. Hello, Adriana, Giancarlos, Felipe. Hello, Graciela from Argentina. Welcome. Hello, Tomas. Where are you from? De donde eres? Hello, Jorge Luis. I recognize many students here. Hello. Excellent. Great to see you. John Carlos is from Colombia. Wonderful. Welcome. Alejandrita is from Colombia also. Excellent. Hello, Leonel. Hi, Sergio from Mexico. Great. Hello, Elida from Guatemala. Hello, Meli. Welcome, Rosa. Excellent. Hi, Merlina. Great to see you. Hello, Giovanni. Wendelin is from New Jersey. Hello, Wendelin. I live near Chicago. I see many more students saying hello. Hello, Espinosa. Oh, Espinosa is Johanna from Honduras. Okay, welcome. Excellent. Adriana is from Mexico. Great. Wonderful, so many students, welcome. Well, today we are going to study pronunciation together with Open English. We are here together with Open English Mode. I am just preparing the technology here on Facebook and Instagram. So very soon we will start the class. I see more people saying hello. Angel is using WhatsApp. Hello, Jesus from Germany, excellent. Welcome, Alejandro. Uh, hello, Acosta. Acosta lives in Tennessee. I have some family in Tennessee, Acosta. Oscar is from Costa Rica. Excellent. Great. There are so many students here. It is great to see all of you. Welcome. I am excited for today's class. Today we are going to study pronunciation. So just a minute, we will start the class on Instagram also, and then we can practice pronunciation together. Did you have a nice weekend? Is everyone having a good day? Como estas? De donde eres? Envía tus comentarios. You can introduce yourself to the class. Good, I see Emily is from Venezuela. Welcome, Emily. Hello, Karina. Hello, Angelica from Chile. Okay, we are going to get ready on Instagram and then we can start today's Open English Mode class. Okay, perfect. It is great to see so many students. Hello, Samir from Peru. Hello, Diana. Wow, it is great to see all of you today. Welcome. Hello, Henry. Hello, everyone on Instagram. Welcome, bienvenidos. It is time for Open English Mode. So, es hora, vamos a comenzar. So, bienvenidos a Open English Mode. Diez minutos de inglés gratis con Open English. Mi nombre es Megan de Chicago, Estados Unidos. Soy profesora de inglés con cinco años de experiencia enseñando en Open English. Hoy vamos a hablar sobre pronunciación para SH and CH. These sounds in English, sh, each. So let me just adjust the volume here for Instagram. Okay, so we are practicing pronunciation together. Let's start with some vocabulary that uses sh and ch sounds. So we want to match the word or phrase to the pictures. Match es emparejar. Try to identify which picture is which word. Send your comments and via tus comentarios. I will read the words in English. So letter A is wash, wash. Letter B is watch, watch. Letter C is chew, chew. Letter D is shoe, shoe. Letter E is matching, matching. 
And letter F is mashing, mashing. So send your ideas and read tus comentarios, which picture matches which word. And welcome, bienvenidos a todos. Welcome to the new students. We are practicing pronunciation together with open English mode. So let's check our answers together. I will watch for your comments on Facebook. Serge says that wash is number three. Okay. Angelo says number three. Adriana says A is number three. Okay, let's check together. So picture number one is letter C, chew, masticar, chew. The dog chews on the toy. Picture number two is letter F, mashing, mashing. So in this picture, we see someone is mashing potatoes, haciendo patatas de puré. Uh, picture number three is a wash. Many students were correct. She is washing the car. Picture number four is letter E, matching. The children have shirts that are matching. Las camisas combinan, they match. Picture number five is letter B, watch. She looks at the time on her watch. And picture number six is letter D. Shoe, shoe. Excellent participation. Great work, everyone. We will continue to study pronunciation together. So, bienvenidos a todos. Estamos estudiando pronunciación con open English mode. So, we are going to read the information and study the charts. We are talking about words in English with sh, sh, or ch, ch sounds. So first, envía tus comentarios. What English words have SH or CH sounds? Send your ideas. And as you type, we can read the information together. So the SH sound in English is long, like a whisper, susoro, like a whisper for silence. Shh, shh. You can continue this sound for a long time. The manner of articulation for this sound is you put your tongue behind your teeth at the top, la lengua está detrás de los dientes, and you push air through your lips. Some example words in English are from our vocabulary, wash, shoe, and mashing. The CH sound is short, like a train. Ch, 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 ch. This cannot be long. This is a short sound, breve, corto. Your tongue is behind your teeth at the top, but it touches the roof of your mouth, tu paladar. And you push a short flow of air through your lips when you move your tongue. Ch, ch, ch. Some example words in English are watch, chew, and matching. So let me check out your comments. What other English words have SH or CH sounds? Envia tus ideas. Alessandra says machine, good. Samir says catch, shadow, shady. Very good examples, excellent. These are great examples, great participation. Very nice work. Let's continue. Vamos a continuar. Let's practice these sounds. Okay, so we want to practice identifying the sound. Which sound? Listen to the story and look at the picture. Decide which words have SH sounds, shh, and which words have CH sounds, ch. Okay, so send your comments and via tus comentarios. I will read the story with words that include SH or CH sounds. Okay, Shannon chooses shoes from the chair. She is matching their shades to her dress. Shannon chooses shoes from the chair. She is matching their shades to her dress. What do you think? Which words have the SH sound? And which words have the CH sound? Send your ideas and via tus comentarios. The words are also listed here, so you can look carefully. 
me see your ideas. Y bienvenidos a todos. Estamos estudiando pronunciación juntos con Open English Mode. We are studying pronunciation together with Open English Mode. Okay. Alessandra says that Shannon is an SH sound and chooses is a CH sound. Excellent, Alessandra, you are correct. Shannon has the SH sound, Shannon, and chooses is the CH sound, chooses. What about other ideas? Shoes, chair, she, matching, shades, and get tus comentarios. Do you hear the SH or the CH? Good, Albert says Shannon is A, excellent. Valeria says shades. Good, I see some examples coming in. Shelly has some great ideas that Shelly says she and shades have the SH sound. Good, Merlina has great ideas for matching and chair. Excellent, very good. Let me type some of these ideas here. So you are correct that shoes have the SH sound, shoes. She has the SH sound, she. And yes, you are correct, shades, tono, shades has the SH sound. Shannon, shoes, she, shades. In the other column for the CH sound, ch, we have chooses, chair, and matching. Excellent participation, great answers here. Very nice work with this pronunciation. And I see on Instagram more examples for words with SH and CH sounds. I saw the word sunshine, excellent, very good. Okay, let's continue, more practice. Tongue twisters or tribal lenguas. Practice saying the tongue twisters. Next, identify the words and names with SH and CH sounds. Remember, SH is sh long and CH is ch short. So send your ideas and via tus comentarios. Y bienvenidos a todos. Estamos estudiando pronunciación juntos con Open English Mode. Okay, the first tongue twister, trabalengua, she shares chairs. She shares chairs. Number two, Chester washes watches. Chester washes watches. And number three, Charlie the sheepdog chews shoes. Sheepdog is pero pastor. Charlie the sheepdog chews shoes. So send your ideas, practice the tongue twisters, try to identify the SH and CH sounds. Excellent participation. I see many great responses here on Facebook. Good, hello, Ligia. Hello, Leslie, great, you are correct, very good. Excellent, let's practice identifying the SH and CH sounds in the tongue twisters. Good, Valeria has some great responses there for she shares, excellent. Okay, so she shares chairs. Valeria had some great ideas. We see that she has an SH sound, she, and we know that shares has an SH sound. Shares, chairs has a CH sound, chairs. She shares chairs. What about number two, Chester washes watches? Jenica says it sounds the same for me. It is okay, Jenica, we will practice together. Abraham says it's confusing, but I got it. Yeah, let's say this in a slower way. I will repeat this more slowly. Cha. Chester, ch, this is short, right? Chester washes, watches. Can you hear the difference? We have Chester with a CH sound. We have washes with an SH sound, washes. And we have watches with a CH sound. Chester washes, watches. What about number three? Charlie the sheepdog chews shoes. Good, I see more great participation here on Facebook and Instagram, excellent, very good. Good, so we see the name Charlie, Charlie. This is a short sound, right, Charlie. What about sheepdog chews 
shoes. Good, Diana says Chester. Good, Betty says watches is in the second column. Excellent, very good. Good, okay, so sheepdog, yes, you are correct. We see that sheepdog has that SH sound. Sheepdog, I can make this long if I want to. Sheepdog, choose, choose, masticar, choose, has that short sound. Charlie, choose. And finally, shoes, zapatos, shoes, has the SH sound. Very nice work, excellent. Tongue twisters can be difficult, but they are fun. And you had many correct responses here. Excellent participation, very nice. So congratulations, everyone. Thank you, it was a great class, great participation. Espero que les haya gustado la clase de hoy. Los esperamos el próximo lunes para que aprovechéis 10 minutos más de inglés gratis con Open English. Y no lo, y no lo olvidéis, inscríbete a nuestro curso en openenglish.com para que dominéis el inglés tan rápido como tú decidas. ¡Te esperamos!